For those of you who have seen my past Alaska videos, you're gonna, you're gonna love this. My friends in Alaska nicknamed me the Snow Queen as, as a joke because I just have impeccable luck in the winter with snow. Well, the joke stands strong today still. Today is Valentine's Day, 2023. Uh, we have me, we have the other Josh who's currently in the back of his truck. You can remember him from the Fenton Lake and Gregorio. Molly, the wife, is in the truck along with my, with my Josh, they're on the truck. Our original plan today was to go up to the San Antonio Hot Springs in the Jemez. Yeah, we wear snowshoes because we were anticipating like a 10 mile hike since five in, five out. Snowshoes, no problem. However, New Mexico got a random snowstorm this week. And um, even getting up to the, the gate to the San Antonio Hot Springs is um, not fully achievable. Because look, that's the road. We'd still have to go around the bend, around another bend, and up a hill. And it is getting deep. And the snow plows have not come up here, so we're kind of assuming actually that they may have closed the road for the day. Po po possibly. No? Yeah. So today's video was going to be the San Antonio Hot Springs, but change of plans. We are changing it up, but we are not giving up on today. Yeah. Okay, we aren't in the Hamas anymore. We're on the opposite. We ended up driving about an eh, hour and a half, give or take. We are now in Santa Fe, ha ha. And we are at the Ojo Caliente Spa. They have a they have day pool for soaking. The trio's over here. Now, this is like a spa resort, but you can come up here for day soaking. But that means there's other people around. It is also Valentine's Day. I don't want to intrude on anyone's privacy or relaxation time, so I won't be filming probably too much in the pools, but we are here. Ojo caliente. You guys ready for a soak? Heck yeah. yeah. Soak time. So, what are your thoughts? It's awesome. It feels great. Yeah. I wish we could have ended up in the mountains. Hey, it's better than nothing. Yeah. We're still in warm water. Yeah. Still in warm water. Hello. <laughs> 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 so, Ojo Caliente. Uh, day passes. For the non-private pools, it is, what was it? It's like 45. Yeah, 45. 45 for the day. Uh, they have three pools open. The salt water is only open seasonally. The salt water pool is not open right now. But there's three pools, so we went to the furthest back one, because it's smaller, we figured less people. There's less people. We're gonna migrate our way back through the pools as we make our way back towards the main area. But uh, we're in the small pool, how about the salt pools? Hanging out here, it's nice and warm. Might not be the Jemez, but it's still a hot springs. Yeah! Some of us have a better tolerance for the cold than others. Some people are crazy, they get out of the hot springs and they go lay in the snow. <laughs> hey, 
Hey, to each their own, right? To each their There's own. Something is wrong with you. <sighs> All right, we've been in the smaller pool, the further out pool by the salt pools for a little while. We are getting a little hungry and we've decided it's time to migrate. It is snowing. It is snowing. It's snowing. But this one needs to eat to feed the living thing in the belly. Yeah, yeah. Definitely food time. You know, growing things requires extra energy. <laughs> so now we're going to make our way in the lovely snow Whoa. to the next pool, well, cafe. So the cafe is next to the secondary pool. Uh, so we're going to hit the cafe and the pool. You know, the toe warmers, the feet warmers, not bad. Yeah. yeah. They're, they're not like super warm, but after airing in the boots for a while, they're a little warmer on bare feet yeah. right now. So apparently, apparently the foot warmers are great for spa days. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's not what they were meant for. No, they went for the meant for, but hey, at least they have some purpose. They work. Something. They work for something. Ah. Now, if you wanted to come here for more than just a day soak, they do have rooms and like, you can get massages, the full the full spa experience if you want to. Obviously more expensive if you're getting the rooms. So, you know, if you're living close by, you could do a day trip, but you know, Valentine's Day, there's a lot of people doing the overnight thing. So, Ojo Caliente, Santa Fe, you should look into it. There's two locations. There's one also closer to Taos. This one's closer for us. We're just doing the day, but maybe we'll have to come back and do an overnighter. The rooms look pretty cool. Maybe get some massages. But yeah, the, a day soak is good for me. Winter. The fuel is being put in for the oven to continue baking. Constant fuel is needed for baking. She's got two. She's got two going. Two. Cool. Two bodies to feed. So food has happened. They have a cafe here, right right next to one of the pools. Fantastic. They've, they've got uh, matcha green tea, like cookies. New, different, new, good, good. What are you eating? Um, chicken club. It's pretty good too. Healthy combination. Healthy combination. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And Josh is over here. What are you drinking? Uh, it's the same thing. You got the Valentine's Day cocktail. Yes, yes. Gin, lemonade, cranberry juice, and some fruit. Pretty good. They do have water. Clean water. They got a whole menu food and drinks galore. And they have like a bar nook. It's cool. All the books are like art museum, cultural based. You can go in there with a drink. Uh, no kids allowed in that section. Sorry, guys. If you have children, just no go. But it's a little chill art zone. It's pretty cool. Good stuff. I fell in. It hurt. <laughs> I fell in. I fell and I hurt my leg. <laughs> it's so relaxing. Yeah, nice, nice shin bash. Cold bread? A cold pool. Did you push a cold pool? So you can dunk in and come back in the box. No, I just like that. <laughs> Molly is terrifyingly watching me hold the camera right now, <laughs> hoping that I do not drop the gimbal because I'm doing this one handed over water. Which is fair. I'm nervous right now as I'm taking this shot. I'm the GoPro nervous. will fare okay. The, the GoPro. GoPro not so much. I don't know if the GoPro will fare okay. It's not in a waterproof case. It's just in a mod, the, medium mod. I think as is, yeah. they are water resistant. We are in the second pool uh, in the middle, not the farthest away, one next to the cafe. Uh, it is a warmer pool than the first yeah, pool, but it's longer, nice like, oh, fountain. Like, it's nice. It's very it's nice. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. <laughs> Good stuff. Good stuff. Good
what happens when you're married for over 10 years? Blood turn level. Stop looking like a butthole and pose. <laughs> she's so mean. She's also pregnant. That's why she's mean. Yeah. I was mean long before I got pregnant. <laughs> 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 We are now in the third pool. Uh, it's the pool closest to the check-in area for the spa slash hot springs, da 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 da, -da. Uh, It's pool one, kind of. There's little circular pools here along the edge of the water. You cannot swim in that water, but you can hang out in the pools. It's like maybe 101 degrees in the water. It's nice and toasty. I think we chased away with an ice over. We've had snow on and off almost reminiscent of uh, Fairbanks Trina Hot Springs. Great times, great times. Hot springs in the snow, I love it. Hot springs are just perfect for the winter. It's but, Ojo Caliente Santa Fe. Definitely worth the day fee for an all day soak. Start for this pool, just wake your, make your way up, hit the cafe. Oh yeah. It's good stuff. Bro, you got a plummet down. Well, and they're talking about pumice stones now. Yeah. Go, go get them, Before it gets dark though, I might as well wrap this up. If you like the video, hit the like button. And if you aren't already subscribed, hit the subscribe button and follow along for more adventures because as always, I promise there will be more. As you know, there might be more hot springs in the future. We've got plenty of them in New Mexico. More hot springs are coming, I promise. But until the next one, you guys have a good one. Later. Things to learn before it gets too dark. <laughs> the pregnant one here. We just got informed as I was doing a shot by the, the staff, which by the way, phenomenal customer service. Super nice, super friendly, stellar. Just making this place better and better. Um, she informed us that there's one of the pools here that's actually called the pregnancy pool. So if you're pregnant, it's at a lower temperature, it's safer for you. So yeah, you know, if you're pregnant, you can still enjoy this place in the pregnancy pool. Good facts to know. And if you want to soak your feet after the swelling, you know, at that point. We aren't there yet, but, you know, eventually. We'll get there. Boof! <laughs> Had to get a pee break. <laughs>